Since the ban was lifted effective 22nd this month, a couple of chartered and emergency flights have touched the Freetown International Airport. But Brussels Airlines, through which the index coronavirus case entered the country, has also been the first commercial flight to touch the country's airspace with 157 passengers on board. Public relations manager for Sierra Leone Airports Authority, Mali Betty Bremer, commented on the COVID-19 safety measures. The government of Sierra Leone through the DSDI initiated what we call the www.travel.gov.so is a travel portal that checks passengers before coming in. And coming in means you have a negative PCR is a requirement and after that filling your HLF is a health located form. And after that when you come to Freetown International Airport you have to go to our government laboratory where you are tested. When asked if passengers coming from high risk countries will be subject to 14 days quarantine or self-isolation, spokesperson for NACOVAC Solomon Jamiru said there have been some improvement and stringent actions have been put in place. For the travel advisory that we have put out for inbound passengers, once you come we subject you to two tests, the rapid diagnostic test and the PCR. If you do the RDT and it turns out to be negative, you're allowed to proceed. Um, awaiting the result of the PCR test. If the PCR test comes out and you're proven to be positive, then they have to take you into an isolation center. General Manager for Sierra Leone Airports Authority, Ebenezer Macaulay says the action to reactivate operations is a boost to livelihood of staff and the country's economy. And those things that we keep in to make sure that nobody comes into this country with a virus, nobody leaves this country with a virus. We also make sure that those things are checked to the letter. Those things that we've maintained, we have to keep them because we want to keep the figures down. If not eradicate the figures, we go want this airport to go back to normal. We know it's difficult, but we try to do as much as we can. One African-American passenger had this to say. I missed Sierra Leone. I was supposed to uh, come in April, had to cancel the flight. So I'm very happy to be back, uh, to see family, friends, and the people that I work with on the various programs. So I'm excited to be back. You know, in the U.S., we've got a lot of cases, so I'm pretty equipped. Uh, I came with my negative COVID test, sand hand sanitizer, a bunch of masks. Sally Fucherna Kamara, AYV News in Lungay.